I believe that's a muskrat. Swimming away. Alright, I just want to get a little bit of this. It looks really old and interesting. Got the winches in the back. Old style. Some kind of, I don't know, makeshift cover on the top. Yeah. Oh, winches in the front. I wonder if it's, it must be a specific design. Double, double seat for the extra large. Huh. Fuel filter. Warning. Altitude? What? Oh, really? It's, uh, interesting. Maybe there's nothing much on this side. Chalice Chalmers. Pumps and pedals. It looks a little dangerous to put your feet down there. Lube oil filter. Hmm. Just realized this is an overgrown baseball park. You don't see too many of them uh, overgrown. You can see the sign over there. Home and away. Wow, what a mess. They piled it with dirt. See, that's the thing about expectations. This fence looks in good shape. It could last another 20 years, but they expected to see more, and they didn't get it, and they just abandoned it. And these are like goat head for the top of my shoes. Goat head for the bottom. Stepping on them, having them poke through my the hole in my shoe. And then these on the top. They poke on the top of my feet. What does this mean? Pending land use action? Got some prices here. This is a pretty assortment of flowers. I got the liberty of seeing the police station. They, they do not have a fence. But the post office does, and a very big one. So it's it's uh, intriguing. There there doesn't there may not be a pattern for post office and police stations choosing to build a fence. It may be I want to say maybe location that is a factor, but we're kind of on the outskirts. I'm about to climb a hill and see what's on the other side. There's some old man driving too. Right, for this berry tree, man, I'd really like to have a sheet. I don't have a sheet. Laundry dry cleaners. <laughs> Steal a sheet from them. I'd really like to have a sheet and just lay it. I'd have to put rocks on all four corners and just shake them limbs. These berries are falling. These seagulls, there's three seagulls around it who are just picking away at all the berries. Yeah, they're eating them up. So I never really, oh, four, five seagulls eating away at these delicious berries. It doesn't take much to knock them out of the tree and they're just so plentiful. I need like a sheet. You know, now that I think about it, I have that tent in my car and stakes. Maybe I could bring that tent over, stake it to the ground and then, and then try to shake to make the berries fall in the tent. It's just how wonky the tent would be. It would be making it difficult to gather the berries when they when after they've landed
speaking Mexican words that rhyme like amigo contigo I don't know if the words work together normally but I think that'd be kind of entertaining when I waited at the food bank I was listening to a conversation one lady said that her lingual squall swelled up so much that her skin split that's just incredible it's something to look forward to 
some kind of concerts at the park over there. This steamboat has its own bus too. American Empire's American Queen Steamboat Company. And they park it, I don't know where, not far from the dock. How often is this held? Like once a once a week or once every couple of weeks? No, it is. Uh, we are here for all every day. Couple, couple of weeks. Couple of weeks every day of every every week. No. Monday through Friday. Uh, we're just here for a two week period. Two weeks. Oh yeah. yeah. So we're like here every two weeks. Two weeks, huh? All right. When you're connected and you know it, clap your hands. Google Maps says I cannot go this way on the road, walking or bicycling. I have to go this way, which is like three miles compared to this would be a nice shortcut on the highway. I don't see any signs discouraging a accessing it. It's one of them bridges that don't have many um, pedestrians. with no protection, uh, at least on this side. All right, trying to get to the Walmart. Want to see what it looks like. I might park Not many organizations will advertise that they provided the toilets, the portable potty. Maybe they, they get tend to get chided for it and that's why they avoid advertising it. Uh, but I don't know. I, I don't know if it could be really a negative thing So this is the Yakima River And it's a very wide sidewalk on this bridge And I think there's a good chance these bones are human bones Look at this a fence that separates the highway from from this trail and that means no animal could get no other animal could get onto the highway with a fence this high maybe it was a car accident and they didn't clean up everything a person could raid these grape um, vines when they're ripe it's not much for security I'm surprised they don't have any kind of deer fence right I'm not sure how fast how fast the leak is, but I want to take full advantage going down this hill on uh, just a freshly inflated tire now. Where's the leg? I don't know. Well, at least we got most of it. There's definitely more bicyclers in, in Richland. say a place is nice and isolated I say nice elated Look, 
check this out. I'm hitting this. And they're just dropping like flies. Just hitting the just hitting the stick. I just gotta align this perfectly. Get it right underneath. Alright, so knocking a few branches has yielded a lot of these things. I just gotta be careful pulling them. I gotta weed through a lot of leaves and stuff, but that's not so bad. Pretty good haul. Alright, well I grabbed way more mulberries than I needed. I'm gonna need to wipe this tent off, the top portion, and it should be good. Try to let it air out a little bit. I got most of the squishing done on the center. And these are way more than I can eat in a sitting. Still have to pick out some some twigs, but it's pretty clean. Pick out a ladybug. I let it. No, it doesn't eat berries. Um, just yeah, over there, and a full one over here. This, I mean, they're really good. They're really delicious. I just gotta pick out the bugs and everything, and eat them till I get sick. I didn't have that just that fine sieve in my car at the end there. I would just squeeze out the juice. These are very, 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 very juicy. Extremely juicy. Stores would never sell these because they're too dark. Too dark of a juice. Too healthy. Alright, so I've, I've caught a, a fly, a ladybug, and then a spider. Well, once again, I wasted my time with the scab because it didn't do anything. The next time I rode, it just started leaking again. And you can hear it. It hiss. Oh, I stopped it by pushing on it. It's like you gotta put the scab on when the tire is full. Because look at this stretching glue on the outside. It's like... It needs to... Stretch, or it needs... Maybe it needs maybe it needs to be thicker. Maybe you need to put all six of them on the one spot so it thickens and then it uh, pushes harder against on the inner wall. A pretty little trailer. this brand before wizard MC so Richland has the safest nuclear plant out of all of them they can reword that to sound funnier least likely to blow up With the broken silver cap on one actually lets me uh, tell them apart. Right, so I paid two dollars and fifty cents for this cheesecloth. It seems kind of worth it because these are not cheap berries. And I got that bowl and that whole bowl in here. I'm gonna squeeze it all into this third pot. I don't, I don't. That's like the maximum amount of pots I got. I, I, I debate whether I should get a fourth one for for whatever off about this much hopefully they'll do take care of all the berries right I think I want to cut off another equal length and then make lay it crosswise because they might spill over the side here all right well this is a bit of a mess I just I keep getting like it's slipping out through the either a rip in this or I'm not sealing it good enough but this cheesecloth is not very reliable I want to say that nothing can beat peanut butter, mulberry juice, and, and uh, yogurts, but I've been getting sick eating everything these days.